I was living in a rental property with me and my three kids. I'd been in there, that rental property, I think about three and a half, nearly four years. Um, and it, I didn't really have a, I wasn't on a, um, a 12 month lease or anything. I could stay what I thought was as long as I wanted. Um, they didn't have any plans of selling the property. And then COVID happened um, and they needed to put the property on the market. And it sold within about three or four months. I didn't really stress about it too much because there's always, it was easy to get another house until I started looking and then I realised how hard it was to get a house, <laughs> really hard. So yeah, I sort of started looking around and what I was finding a lot of time is they were going before you would even get to the viewing. You get online, you look at the property and then you say you want to view it and then constantly at work I've been saying to the girls at work, I've got to, I've got to leave five minutes early, like work were really good and I said I've got to leave five minutes early, I've got a viewing. And then half an hour before the viewing, you get an email and said the property's gone. So this house came up for rent online. I applied for it, somebody else got it. And then I was actually on the phone to my girlfriend the night before my place had sold and I said, I don't know what I'm gonna do now. Like I was really, really stressed. A lot of anxiety was starting to come back. I was thinking, what the hell am I gonna do? The next day, her son, he was at his mate's house whose mum works at a real estate and he'd mentioned us. So she flicked me her emails. I said, I'm a single mom, I've got three kids, I've got great references. And she rang me and she said, I've got one property. Can you beat a viewing in 20 minutes? And I couldn't. And I just said, I'll just have it. And it was this house, but 20 people applied. So I'm grateful that I got a house, but there's lots of people out there that still haven't got a house. I am worried about the end of the moratorium in March because before I was paying $310 a week rent, I'm now paying $370 a week rent. And they've already sent out letters to talk to property managers about the rent increase. So I'm freaking out thinking, how much is this rent gonna go up?